when we were in school. There was a boy who was studying with me who had an excellent hand, you know, he could just sketch anybody with whatever kind of distortion he wanted. <laughs> so, there was one very hated geography teacher. <laughs> and uh, when he entered the class, this boy had a horrible caricature of him ready on the blackboard. Badly distorted, but everybody can clearly recognize who it is. <laughs> With all kinds of very bad distortions on him. <laughs> then he walked in and uh, as usual he walks into the class always with a temper. Whether he is talking about the grasslands in America or he talks about the deserts in Africa, he is always in bad temper. <laughs> he, the moment he saw, he just… Uh, one thing he was angry, another thing he was somehow hit by the whole thing, the distortions. <laughs> Then he asked, who is uh, responsible for this uh, terrible atrocity? As usual, you know, everybody is suddenly interested in geography, very studious <laughs> and <laughs> mm, Then he repeated again, who is responsible for this atrocity? He thinks it's an atrocity. We thought it was an appropriate <laughs> thing. Then uh, somebody made up their mind and stood up and said, uh, we really don't know, uh, but uh, it should be his parents. this atrocity that you call as myself, it's not your parents. <laughs> this is you. <laughs> Only you can commit this atrocity of distorting yourself into such a tiny possibility when an unbounded possibility was what you were offered. With life you were offered an unbounded possibility. You made a, such a bad distortion and made yourself into such a tiny possibility. If you stop creating this caricature, because this caricature cannot exist one day without your support, you need to support it all the time. What meditation means, means in one way you're just withdrawing the support for your personality, that's all. Suddenly it collapses, only the presence is there, the person is no more there. If you could walk on the street like this, if you could operate with people like this all the time, that you have no personality, but looking at this person at this moment, how she is, accordingly you put up a personality, as it is necessary for this person. Now you go to that person, you put up a personality that is necessary for that person, then it would be so much fun drawing new, new caricatures every day. But once you get stuck to a particular distortion, <laughs> that becomes a problem. Every day if you have a new distortion, it's called art. <laughs> if you're stuck with one distortion, then it's called… you're called a freak. Isn't it? <laughs> isn't it so? Every day if you're able to create a new distortion, that is artwork, isn't it? If you're stuck with one distortion, you're a cripple. <laughs> So that's the big difference.